Edmentum Custom Course Builder gives program and account administrators the flexibility to modify, design, and build courses to meet the unique needs of your district, school, and students. This easy to use feature allows you to locate and assemble content quickly and easily and collaborate with peers along the way. Let's take a deeper look at how Custom Course Builder can offer the added flexibility that you need. Account administrators and program administrators can access Custom Course Builder by clicking into their navigation menu and selecting the Custom Course Builder under Resources. The first time you go to the page, you'll see a message that says you have no custom course drafts, and it'll give you the option to start creating. However, if you already have drafts created, you will see them listed here. Under the drafts header, you'll see any unpublished drafts that you have created or that have been shared with you. Under the header of the published course, you can see any of your published custom courses. Let's start by clicking on the green button that says Create Draft to walk through the full process of creating a custom course from start to finish. To begin, name your custom course and select a subject. Selecting a subject is optional, but it will prove helpful in keeping your custom courses organized. Now that you're in your Draft Builder workspace, the next step to building your custom course is to select the content. You can do this by selecting from Plato courses. These are the courses that are available in your account. Selecting content from Plato titles. These are supplemental modules that are available in your account. Selecting from custom courses. These are custom courses that have previously been published in your account. Or by browsing standards and selecting aligned content Let's go ahead and start by clicking on Courses. You'll notice that now you have a list of subjects to choose from, or you can simply select all and use the search bar to browse for the course name you would like to build from. With the search bar, you can quickly find the course you want by simply typing in the course name. Once you've found the course you'd like to start with, you can expand the course to see the content within it. You can even preview the content by clicking on it. Now, let's drag and drop some items over to our drafting area on the right. You can drag over an entire unit, a module, or other activity from within the course. You can add content from multiple courses into your custom course. And don't forget, as you build, you can click on the pin next to the content that you may want to use for later. You can even search for content in different ways while building your custom course. For instance, I just added a unit from a course to my custom course. Now, I want to search by standard to add more content to my course. In addition to adding content from your account to your course, you can also add custom content. One of the custom items that you can add to your course is a document. Educators often use this feature when they want to provide an additional resource to their students. After you've named your document, you can upload a file, take a picture, or share a link. Now that you've picked your file, click the button that says Add Document. Another custom content is the Digital Dropbox Activity. Use a digital Dropbox activity to add a project or an assignment that requires students to create a work product and submit it. Similar to the Add Document feature, you will need to pick a file and give some directions. You can embed videos or photos into your directions. Once you have included the content you want, click Add Digital Dropbox to complete. You can preview this content once it's been added. You can also add a custom discussion activity to your course. Simply name the activity and provide the discussion topic or prompt. Note the ability to embed links, images, or videos. Finally, you can add a web link to the course if you would like your students to research outside content. In the course construction area, you have the ability to move content up or down 
remove content, move content out of or into units, and remove content altogether. You can even add units to your course and move contents into it and choose whether to add a pretest or a post-test. Before you publish your course, you may want to get feedback from your peers. You can share your course with fellow program administrators or account administrators in your account and give them access to either edit or only view the draft. Only the person who created the draft, the owner, can delete or publish the draft. Once the content in the course is finalized, the course needs to be published in order to be assigned to students. Let's click on the blue Publish button to move forward. Here, you can choose which catalogs in your account you want to publish the course to. This gives the flexibility for the admin to make the course visible to only the intended programs. Because the content in a custom course cannot be edited once the course is published, you'll be alerted if there are any obvious issues. In this course, there is a unit post-test and a unit pre-test that don't have any questions. This can be fixed by either adding modules to the unit, removing the pre and post-test, or removing the unit altogether if it isn't needed. Now my course is ready to be published. Now that my course is published, I have a record of who published the course and the date and time it was published. If I notice that there is an issue with the name of the course or the subject, I can edit the name and the subject, but only if I'm an account administrator, as changing the course name changes it everywhere in the account. Once your course is complete, you can assign it to students by creating a new section directly from Custom Course Builder. Or, sections can be created from your course catalog where your custom course now lives. Or, sections can be created from the Manage Courses area. Thank you for watching this tutorial. Now you're ready to use Custom Course Builder to create custom courses to address the varying needs of your students.